Hello, and thank you for tuning in to Pets Nature. Today, I just wanted to take a moment to show you all my juvenile leopard gecko, Reggie. He's on my hand right here, just exploring. Crawling around like he always does. I've had Reggie for about a month now, and in that time he has already doubled in size and shed three times. When I first got him, he hated being picked up, but now look at him. This is his favorite position, or what he was just in. He's on the move now, as always. Loves to explore, as any reptile should, and he loves to get out of his enclosure. I feed him mostly crickets, superworms, and mealworms. I am now going to be putting Reggie back in his enclosure. Go on, little one. But yeah, this is it. This is where the magic happens. This is Reggie's Mayan temple. Underneath the reptile carpet, there is a heating pad. And I also have a basking bulb. Although leopard geckos generally don't bask, they still do like the heat. This is his moist hide right here. I generally just use a paper towel. When I first got him, I was using moss, but it was way too much of a mess, so I switched to paper towel, and it still does the trick. Over here is his food bowl. There's a bunch of mealworms in there right now, as well as his watering bowl and his cool hide. If you can actually see, there is a crack in the log. It's plastic, and when I first got it, I dropped it, broke it in two. So I had to hot glue it back together. But if you'll notice, there's still a tiny little opening in there. And one time I found a superworm crawl into it, and I tried to get it out, but I just pushed it deeper in. So there's a dead superworm in there, and there's nothing I can do about it. Here's the view of the whole tank. I have a nice backdrop for Reggie to remind him of his home in Afghanistan, in the mountains, in the rocks, in the desert. And then I just have some fake plants over here, just to spice it up. This is actually real, as well as this, this, and this. Here's Reggie's favorite spot, underneath the temple, on the heating pad, sleeping most of the time. You can actually see his eyes closed. Well, almost closed. But yeah, that's all I have for you guys today. So if you enjoyed the video, please leave a thumbs up and do subscribe. I'm planning on making a lot more videos like this in the future. Thanks for watching.